completely rebuilt a guy's handicapped bathroom and painted the whole side of the house, um, fixed the gutters, cleaned up the yard, oh my God. Um, fixed his roof, um, put lights, put lights in his bedrooms because they didn't have any lights. Um, it was it was pretty. It, it, that was that was that was a long kind of a long day. So what they did, they took the uh, beams, the porch beams out, and secured it with something else to hold it up until it's replaced. My back door is uh, is swollen. It doesn't want to cooperate, so I'm filming through a little cubby hole here. This is what that wheelchair ramp looked like. I am so excited. Yeah. Really busy. Everybody's cutting and the ladies are on the back. And here the sick puppy is leaving. Right, so here we are. All those pretty t-shirts got dirty. Isn't that sad? Yeah. The young, the young man stacked the wood the way I need it. Meanwhile, this has come the long fine. And a garbage truck snuck up on me. I didn't see it. I was in the back of the ladies. And there it goes. Yeah, oh yeah. I'm amazed I'm still here. They have, they have newspaper tubes. You I had no idea. idea. Can you repeat that? Newspaper. <laughs> We're talking about slugs We're here, right? We're talking about slug solutions. You take newspaper and roll it in so it's a newspaper tube, mm -hmm. and then the slugs will crawl inside, especially early morning when it's damp out and it's damp and dark, and they all climb inside and then you just throw the newspaper away. Oh, how cool. No pesticides. No pesticides. Oh, how cool. And you can put it on the edge of your garden and then go down the walk in the morning. So do you like stomp on it first before you <laughs> throw it away? Or? Not me. Oh, okay. No. That's... I better get a, I I better get a subscription the to the Daily O. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I got a lot of slugs. Uh, yeah. Do you have any remedies for? For slugs? No, for anything. <laughs> for, for anything? anything? <laughs> <laughs> Epsom salt. Epsom salt. Epsom yeah, it does everything. Yeah, it does everything. It does, yeah, it does, it's good for muscle aches, baking aid, soda, fever, and Epsom salt. sunburns. Yeah. But everything. it is not good for a person with heart disease. It goes after your heart. Oh Ooh, yeah, that well, might be true. It does, huh? Yeah, because huh. it's mm -hmm. salt. You next. Salt. You next. Your your turn. <laughs> <laughs> um, my solution for weed problems is. Get a kid with a weed eater. There it is. Cool. That right solves there. the problem. In right? action. Look at him go. But we, him before go. we got to that, we had to get and it's, a lady. And it's no pesticides. See? Right. No, yeah, no chemicals. But before we got the weed eater, I needed a lady to get under the couch and find it. Uh, yeah, <laughs> his yeah. mom. His but mother. See, oh, his mother. It, yeah. All right. You got it. And they're going at it. Mm -hmm. And another one is if you have cedar chips. Yeah. If you put them along the edges of your house and you have pets walking on the cedar chips, it's a natural repellent for fleas. Oh. Yeah. Oh. Lavender and peppermint oil oh. is oh, the so flea thing, yeah. Put, uh, so is cedar. Mm -hmm. Natural repellent. Yeah. Well, here, I'm going to get my gloves for home. There's a young man weed eating. Now, keep in mind, um, I was going to get a wheelchair ramp. In the meantime, the yard is clean. My garden is being planted. Uh, my gutter got fixed. 
And uh, if you think my house was a mess, you're absolutely right. But that fly bush got cut, and it'll be resurrected any minute. There you go. Ah. The wood got stacked. There's a lady getting ready to cut the windows. Way down here is Miss Angela making sure the holes are fixed. Uh, n holes, animals get under there. Yep, she's helping with your skirting. Yeah. She said. Yeah. The garden is getting put in. Yeah, I can live on tomatoes and zucchinis. Oh, and uh, you actually doing this properly. I just take my finger and I run it from one side to the other and I throw the seed in it and I say, now grow. <laughs> well, I'm giving them a few inches in between, but I've planted two little mounds here. Uh -huh. of oh, how cool. We even know what it is. Uh, two miles down the road, we're doing another project where we're actually taking off a whole bunch of old siding. Oh, God. And uh, replacing it. That's, uh, there's about 15 real contractor types crawling all over that one and uh, that was going real well. I, she's a veteran and so we had uh, uh -huh. we delivered a flag and some red, white, blue balloons over there. That's a Heroes at Sears Heroes at Home sponsored project. Oh how wonderful, yeah. It is going to get all done one day? Well, they're, they'll come back in a couple of weeks and paint. Right and now they're paint. putting up the siding and caulking and, and we'll have uh -huh. a crew come back uh, probably next weekend and then do the painting. But most everything else is going to get done in one day. Yeah, it's amazing, huh? It is, yeah. Yeah, thank you. You're welcome. Lots of fun. We got to be safe. <laughs> Meanwhile, home at the ranch, I was going to go home, and I forgot I didn't have a front door, so I have to go to the back. <laughs> and originally, I thought it was real uh, unlikely that a person could forget they don't have a door. So the gentleman said, yes, just in case, I want nobody to get hurt. And look at here, I forgot I didn't have a front door. Yeah. And she's been hearing the whole thing. <laughs> oh, hello. <laughs> you guys are taking each other's split. Yeah, she's been. Janine, uh, what's your name, young lady? She doesn't know you, Marge. Marge, hi, Marge. Hi. I got, you see, you got a green shirt on, so I guess you belong here. <laughs> Let me see if I can get on the corner here. I can. Yeah. That's a plus there. Getting there. Wow. We are at a quiet time at this evolution. Everybody's speechless. It looks so good. The swing is up. The table is up. Oh my goodness, I can live in vitamin D all summer. When it's 1.30, my day started. I combed my hair. I had pictures taken without combing my hair. And I'm really emotional right about now because this is such a wonderful thing. That is, that's, a, that's the only thing left from NNN's uh, outlet.
Lacey. I remember that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh. It's a compressor running. Yep, awesome story. There and there this week. Uh -huh. This stuff right here, it's um, it's actually rough. Uh huh. But if you want like like how the other one has like slits. Gonna go, gonna do the whole and here it is, our new wheelchair ramp. <laughs> and everything is beautiful. You gonna stay with me for a few minutes? <laughs> yeah, yeah, for sure. Okay. Yeah. I just gotta take off my shoes before I go in your yeah, house. Yeah, I'm a little. I'm, I'm a little. That. And here we are. It's raining and storming. And here are the wonderful people. Good job. Here she comes. <laughs> Good job, Lil. Now we're coming up. Oops. You can make it. I, I, I can do this? Yeah, you can. Cool. Yeah. <laughs> oh, help. <laughs> All right, back oh. up. Whoops. What do you, whoops. What do you do? I don't know. <laughs> I gotta back it up. This is the tricky part. We're not gonna. It's a slideshow by Jim Picasso. I hope I said that right, you know how bad I am on names. This is over at my place. Um, unfortunately, uh, I don't remember all the names, but you going, you, you're going to be familiar with these people before it's all said and done. Uh, this is over at, uh, at Polly Williams' house. She's a veteran, and uh, they put sightings in. I'm assuming it's the same place where the siding was put on. There were so many projects going on for that one day. Now the music you're listening to is by T. Brame Jr. And all these happy people. It was raining and hailing. Just this is Polly there. Was Polly there? And uh, I still don't see how all this can be done in one day. I am just amazed. Um, this is Dave Rockwell construction. This is one of the ladies that helped me. And we're back to my place here. Happy faces in the rain. In the rain. I can't stress that enough. Now, if there's a little disturbance in my footage here, I'm taking this off of a website. And sometimes cameras and um, computers don't want to work so good together. This was uh, George, the contractor here. And that's a uh, Jim. And I'm so bad on names. You're still happy. It was almost towards the end of the day. Garden finish. Rebuilding together. There we go. Everything has to be so precise. I would assume when you're dealing with that many people, if one person is off by half an inch, nothing works. I so admire people that can do things with their hands. You know, in this day and age, we all have to have degrees and 
technology and all of that, but I always thank the people that do things with their hands. Here we go, Asha remodeling and Dickie's remodeling.